number one, welcome our new insect overlords. Look at all of these bed bugs. They are everywhere on this bed. All of these little black dots, that is the bed bug droppings and it stains the metal there. And the cluster of that dark brown area, those are the adult bed bugs, the baby bed bugs, and the little white dots you see, those are the bed bug eggs. And if you look at the mattress up here, they are all over the mattress as well. And the worst part is guys, this isn't some science experiment. Someone actually sleeps here and these bed bugs feed on them every single night. Do you feel a chill up your leg now? Oh my god, I actually do feel a chill. What the fuck? Put them up. Oh, it's already going. Okay. So yeah, as soon as it got on that skin. Oh, I can feel a little bit. I felt a little prick. So yeah, I'm wondering how much more at once because it looks pretty full to me. About nine minutes in. Gosh, that's crazy. Fortunately, this is not an ancient ritual to summon a Lovecraftian god, but rather a ritual where termites will now lick their queen to death. But how does that work? Termite queens can get pretty massive, as you can clearly see. But luckily, thick thighs create lives, as the queen uses all of her energy to make eggs. In return, the termites feed and clean her so she can continue her job. However, once she's on the way out, her termite children gather around her to lick her to death, drawing out all of the fluid and, yes, fats from her body. However, without a queen, this means that the termite mound eventually dies out. I have never in my life seen a worm this damn long. Wait, what is that? Look his head. Is that his head? Wait. What the fuck is this? That disturbing worm is a hammerhead worm, or as I like to call it, a landchovy. Fun fact, this landchovy's mouth also serves as its anus. Excuse me. This is an Ichiroptera manga, and no, not like this kind of manga. It's a giant stick bug, and it's a colorful male for mating purposes. In fact, it won't even try to get a female unless its blue is dazzling enough. 